It's so crazy. Like all these tips are literally what made me get through it. I swear to you. What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. First of all, I'm going to be giving you guys some tips on how to lose weight and, and maintain it. So how to lose weight and I don't know why it's so difficult for me to explain it. How to lose weight and how to maintain the weight loss. Amen, amen, amen. Okay. While I make a gingerbread house and you know what's crazy? I've never seen this in my life. It's a chocolate chip. A chocolate chip gingerbread house. Are you tripping? Like if if only the gingerbread part was soft, it would get. But I'm gonna get started because yeah. How many of these? Eight, nine, and so this all y'all day. I probably should have looked at the bag. But they low key, I should try to make it look like the picture. I'm gonna try to make it look like the picture. And I need something to put it on. So as we start, I'm gonna go ahead and start with the first little bullet point or the first tip I would give. And it hurts me when I see people do this because I'm like, I, yeah, I used to be in your shoes. I used to be in your shoes. But one thing you can't do is compare yourself to other people. Yeah, that girl may have a badonka donk. But do you want a badonka donk? Okay, then give yourself a bananga donk. Work for the bananga donk. You want a flat stomach and some juicy thighs? Work for a flat stomach and juicy thighs. You want uh, guns like uh, me? Uh, uh, you gotta just, if you want it that bad, work for it. But don't ever compare yourself to other people because that, at the end of the beginning of the day, you comparing yourself to them is not gonna make your body change. It's not gonna make how you see yourself change. Like, that's why my favorite saying is become, that's why my favorite saying is become the best version of yourself because it's just you. Why is it this small? The only, the biggest piece of advice I would give when it comes to people comparing themselves is that's fine you want to change yourself that's fine you don't you don't like the way you look so work to get to that to the place that you want to be comparing yourself puts you in a deep dark hole of nothingness and guess what's going to come out of it nothingness because that's it's, it's, it's nothingness why do i want to bite it okay anyways let's be for real Let's be for real, Shatiya. Let's be for real. Uh, instead of me comparing myself, I just say, wow, look at her. Wow, look at her body. Instead of saying, must be nice, come on now. It probably is nice, but come on now. Or saying, I'll never get there, come on now. Be for real. That girl could have, whoever that is, could have worked for where she is. And you could do the same thing. I should probably put this on the cookie sheet. Okay. Uh, that really helped me to like get right and not really give up, I guess, is finding meals that you like. So when it comes to like weight loss, people always think, oh, I have to eat like solids and I have to, you know, I might have to, um, I have to eat like bland chicken and oh no, 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 no. You do not have to do that. Throughout my weight loss, I didn't eat anything that I don't like, for instance. I got a big hatred for cooked spinach. I don't know what it is, but like, it's just, it's disgustingly disgusting. I like spinach, but cooked spinach is wild. You know spinach is like one of the top, top, top vegetables and whatnot. Who didn't eat a lick of spinach? Me. You have to find replacements. Okay, hold on. Oh wow, on a on a blank side of the back cottage wall. Pop on. But anyways, 
Um, yeah, five meals that you like. For instance, my favorite meal of all time in my existence of living, if you know me, you probably know, is wings. Wings gonna always do it. Like, always do it. Did I stop eating wings? No. No. I ain't stopped eating no wings and I was up there at the, I was, <clears throat> but I had to find a better version, a healthier version, because you know wings are fried, wings are bread and all that stuff. I had to find a better version of it, so I did. Did I do this right? I started eating baked wings. A lot of baked wings aren't breaded. I started eating roasted wings, smoked wings, like those three were my top tier. And there's so many restaurants that have like that, or you can come here and air fry some wings. I do that too. Like when I crave wings, I just air fry them joint and season them right, and they're gonna taste good. Like find meals for you. If you are obsessed with burgers, you just love your burgers. And this is just this is just an example. If you just love your burgers so much, you can get you know, still do your burgers. Burgers are good. They're, they're still good for you. When I was on my diet, I ate lettuce wrap burgers because I try to stay away from carbs, which that's a whole nother topic. But I had lettuce wrap burgers. This thing is killing me. You get the gag. If you want to stay away from carbs, find you some carb smart bread. If you don't care for the buns, try a lettuce wrap burger. I ate those so much and they're so good. People say like a lettuce wrap burger is just like a salad. It's not. You get that, now it's just two different things. It still gives you that experience, but find meals that you like and that's you. Is this the right one? Spaghetti. Get you some, you trying to stay, stay away from your carbs? Get you some Carb Smart or whatever spaghetti noodles. Everything else is still still good for you, still straight. You the meat, the ground turkey, the sauce, that's good. Like. And you just season it up and spazazz it up the best way you can. Um, this thing say let let it dry. Who's letting it dry? Just cause you trying to eat healthy don't mean you gotta eat raw healthy. Like, all right. Um. Okay. Another thing. Everything is mental, right? Everything. Everything is mental. You know, some of it is physical. Hey. 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 Yeah. When it comes to working out in the gym, it's all mental. Like, I had to notice that on the Stairmaster. When I when I be on the Stairmaster, like, I be having to push in my head to push myself. If you're telling yourself your body, you're telling yourself you're tired and da-da-da-da-da, you're going to start feeling, you're going to start feeling a little tired. Like, it's all mental. Don't, don't be saying in your head, oh, I can't do this. Oh, it's too hard. It probably is going to be hard. But girl, how bad do you want it? How bad do you want it? That's another thing. You got to want it bad. Like, you got to want it. You got to want it. Next one is diets don't work. It's, it's a lifestyle change. This one, I had saw somebody say this. And I was like, wow, that is actually true. So let's say, right, and I hate when, like, my family be like, oh, she's on a diet. Bruh, I'm not on a diet, babes. This is, I've been, if I'm on a diet, then I'm a, I've been on a diet for two years. Like, it's it's not a diet that you need to be doing, it's a lifestyle change. So let's say, okay, you, you, you're you done with your diet, right? But you just gonna go back to eating everything in the world that you was eating before that, that is the reason why you wanna do this diet, like, Ooh, this wall work this wall working me like yeah for instance let's say you're over here you eat McDonald's for breakfast you eat all takeout fat like you know what you eat. you eat and you know if you're just eating horrible right and then all of a sudden you're like okay period I lost five pounds I'm done then you go back to eating all that stuff that you were eating to start with. And then you're wondering, why did I gain this weight back? So since it is a lifestyle change, taking out the food that you enjoy is wild to me. Like 
you should not be eating salads every day if you don't bump with salads every day. I like salads. For me personally, I like salads. So I can, I can rock with a salad, but doing my weight loss thing as well, I discovered Chipotle. Uh, my mom had always gotten it and I never got it, but I discovered Chipotle on my weight loss too. And they really know how to dress up their salads, you know? So yeah, but it is a lifestyle change, you know? I didn't even notice it until like I started thinking of like topics to talk about. I was like, wow, it's a whole like lifestyle change. Like for breakfast before, I was probably eating Pop Tarts for breakfast, eating just cereal, all the worst things in the world that you could probably think of, I was eating. But now I won't think twice about it. I'll make myself eggs, bacon, sausage, like the, the, the good stuff for the good stuff for me. Like, it, I changed my whole lifestyle. I eat different. That doesn't mean like I still don't have like, you know, my Taco Bell and you know, da da da. But speaking of Taco Bell, like I've been craving it and Chick-fil-A, but I'm trying to finish the rest of my journey. And if I stick through it, I'll, I'll be happy. So I'm just not even gonna, I'm not even gonna dip and dab in that. Just keep that in mind. Period. Just be prepared for that. Keep that in the back of your mind. And it'll also like, I think, and this, you know, my personal, you know, it'll make you feel better about those days when you do decide you want to get Taco Bell or you do decide you want to get da da da, like, yeah. Oh, I was supposed to make it on this thing, I think. What was I? Oh, and I was. Period. She's cute. Ooh. I'm gonna actually take this down because this is getting on my. Ooh, 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 ooh. Period. Let's do this top part. And they got a little gummy bears on the top. So I'm gonna put a little gummy bears on the top. She's kind of cute already. She's kind of cute already. It's giving. Next thing. Carbs are your friend. Okay, throughout my journey, in the beginning, like when I didn't go to the gym and stuff, I tried to stay away from carbs. Um, carbs are your friend. I feel like carbs give you, and not until like July is when I started like incorporating carbs into my diet. It's so wild. Carbs are looked at as horrible things. And there's there's two different there are, there's different definitions of carbs. Like you have your like healthy carbs, which are like freaking like rice and and like pasta is a healthy carb. But I'm not so like not a healthy carb is like donuts. You know you have to know the difference between the carbs. But carbs are a lot better for you than you think, and I think they should be incorporated into your diet, or at least, at least some into your diet and i know i just i just said i hate when it's called diet but i don't mean diet I, that's just what i call what i call what i eat every day my diet i don't know they just want you to i think especially when working out like they really your friend then i feel like they give you the energy oh i made this hole too thick and they got this door looking petite and whatnot <clears throat> back door okay bye they got these little lamp things right here in the front of the house y'all tripping i'm gonna do that let's get some of these little balls on there my holes are too like the hole in this thing is like too big the last little point i have is you can't buy your weight loss and when i say that i mean like a lot of people think I wonder if this is chocolate. Like these little supplement things, like these these little pills. Y'all know what I'm talking about. You look the little pills you like see the ads for saying, oh, if you get this, you'll lose 30 pounds just from taking the pill. I need to go caps to y'all. I was one of them. I was one of them. I this one time I remember I have like $15 to my name. Like, this was a 
This was, I think, when I was in college. So it was like 2018. Or right before I went to college. But I was one of them. I had like $15 to my name. I was like, okay. I want these. They had these little these little things that um it was like lose what uh lose da -da -da pounds if you take the pill like make it make sense like make it make sense how 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 them don't work hey they might they might they, but they probably don't like there are though i won't knock them off there are things like that could help you when it comes in regards to your weight loss. So like pre-workout or like if you're going to the gym or like the the greens or my greens or whatever. I take my greens every morning. And what the greens do for me, people be like, oh, it doesn't work. Oh, it doesn't work. Saying that, but probably haven't even tried it. If you take them greens, you won't feel them things work. That like they, they, it's for your gut health, so it like pretty much clears out your gut for you without taking like a laxative, but then it off. <clears throat> oh my gosh, my light film. But then like, it also incorporates your green intake for the day. So like your vegetable intake for the day, and, or not for the day, but a, a, an intake of it. I don't know about for the day. But like that does work. Those do work. And y'all may think, and this ain't even hashtag sponsored because I ain't even mention no, I ain't even mention no um company. But like the greens, I use Bloom. Them the only the Bloom and Alani. Them two work. But like the greens, they I feel like they just they clear your system out, you know. So I think there's certain supplements, but the ones that be like, oh, lose lose thirty pounds in ten days if you take this pill. No way. What you trying to kill me, babe? That's what it's giving. It's giving kill me in 30 days. But, yeah, you hang by your weight loss. I mean, I didn't. I mean, oh, shoot, unless you get, you know, you some, uh, what is it, lipo? Or you do the little surgery. I don't knock that either. That would be a lot quicker than, uh, yeah. But, no. Ooh, 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 ooh. Shoot. They all over the floor, y'all. They're all over the floor. I think I'm done. I think I'm done. And there's still icing left, so. Now introducing, now introducing Betty's House of the North. Kind of cute. That I that is it for today's video. I had fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I hope you guys got some tips from it. I love giving out these little tips, tricks, and niche that you guys can use and whatnot. I think all of these tips that I gave though really helped me throughout my weight loss and my journey. And I think they're just really good tips in general. Like a lot of them are, and I think a lot of them will help a lot of you guys go through your journey as well. But I love you guys so much. I will see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 6. One of them days. I love you guys. Make sure you guys comment down below any videos you guys want me to do in the future. Comment if you guys have any tips yourself that you want to leave for other people. Um, and yeah. I love you guys so much. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.